Hi, Greg here again, and today I want to have a look at the difference between building and viewing or, or viewer only, if you like. Uh, one of the things that Avi and I find is that sometimes students forget uh, to use the publish button, and so any changes that they've made in what we call build mode, where you're building content, isn't reflected when somebody goes to look at it. The other thing that we really want to try and avoid is for somebody to send us a link to a really generic Weebly page which doesn't reflect uh, your website and your work. So this shouldn't take very long. So I'm going to use this test page and just build some very very simple elements and we'll see what this looks like in terms of then publishing so that we get the correct link when you guys turn in uh, the location of your ePortfolio. So let's just say that I wish to place an image. And so my image is there. Now I want to show you a little trick. Avi might also do this. Ah, my morning makeup tip, how to fill in your eyebrows. Excellent. So let's say that I wanted to link out to this article or website. One of the better ways that I can do that that's more visual is to take my snipping tool and to highlight a picture and at this point I'm just going to do a save as I'm going to throw it on the desktop and we're going to call it uh, makeup and then what we can do now is we can upload that image there we go and that's going to come in. Now the cool thing about this is if I click on it you'll see that there's a link button here and I can link out to a number of things including other files, um, email, but probably the one we use the most is the website URL and at this point if I go up top and I copy that and I paste it and I paste it Try that again. Let's do a copy, paste, excellent. And you'll notice I have clicked open a new window. I think that's more functional. And so now this has become linked to that article. Now I probably would want to put a little bit of a text underneath or a title, you know, makeup tutorial, how to fill in eyebrows. Okay, and I click there. Now, this is great. We've done all the work, but until I actually publish this, the viewer doesn't get to see those changes on my website. Okay, so I actually have to hit publish at this point, and you'll see that this is my Weebly address, and that is the one that you would submit to Avi or I showing us where your website is at or the URL. And it's really important that you check links. So I click on it, I've got a password. And so if I go down to that test page, you'll notice that I have my picture here. And right away I get the finger, the good finger. And that's telling me that it's gonna be linked out to something and bada boom, the link works. I think it's really important that you check your links to make sure that any changes you've made happen. And again, uh, I can close this up now. Remember that the publish button needs to be used and that you're going to actually send to us this URL and not a generic Weebly one. Hope this helps. Take care. Bye.